This is probably the most unconservative policy and idea ever thought out by a so-called conservative government. It infuriates me, if I'm honest. Now, what I'm talking about is a universal basic income of £1,600 a month to be trialled in two places here in England. It's already been trialled in Wales, of course, Socialist Wales, and it's giving people money for nothing. Absolutely nothing. You can sit on your ass at home all day and do nothing and get all this money. This is a lot of money, even for people who are working. There are people who are working in Britain today after they've paid all their bills and they have families have like a pittance, maybe up to 400 quid if they're lucky to live on. And they have to be careful with that money. And the parents work their asses off. They do long hours. They are away from their families. And yet this idea comes out. I mean, this is the sort of idea you would expect to come out from a Labour government, a socialist, wasteful government. This is a great way to bankrupt a nation. It really is. And as a taxpayer, it'll be me paying for this because I work. And all you people out there who work as well, who work your asses off to support yourselves and your families, put expensive fuel in your cars to get to work, put food on the table, pay the mortgage, pay the rent. And as a taxpayer, as someone who will be funding this, I want to know who authorised it and what primary legislation enables it. That money does not come from nowhere. It comes from people who graft for a living, who work. So why the hell should uh, people get this money funded by people who, who graft? Well, uh, these two places, I don't know where they are yet. They will be getting equivalent to £22,000 a year salary after tax and for nothing. And what's the idea behind all this? Uh, is AI, artificial intelligence, really going to take over people's jobs? So... The governments will just give people money. And what happens to that money if you express the wrong opinion online? They'll have control over you. There are banks, building societies, closing down the accounts of, of right-wing conservative social media users because they don't like what people like us are saying, which is the truth and common sense. So if you get this £1,600 to live on eventually, do you have to toe the line? Do you have to think a certain way, do things a certain way? Will it be tied to digital currency? And if so, will it be used to reward and punish? It's an absolutely crazy, mental, insane idea. And I was listening to uh, James O'Brien on LBC this morning. He is a massive uh, multimillionaire champagne socialist. And his argument was he, he didn't care that this money came from people uh, multi-millionaires etc who own businesses because it's nothing to them but even though they are businessmen multi-millionaires uh, luxury lifestyles these people still work for that money they work a business takes time and effort because you're not looking after just a business you're looking after the people your employees so why the hell should people who have worked hard to get what they want and enjoy the lifestyle that they deserve because they work for it why should the money that they've worked for go to people who don't do anything to earn it, to sit on their asses? I don't know, it's just, it really does infuriate me. This is a classic socialism 101. Spread the wealth just to make sure that everyone is the same level of poor. To make sure that the poor stay poorer as long as the rich are less rich. To quote the late great Iron Lady Margaret Thatcher. And what are these people going to do with this money? If they're going to trial this in a, a council estate, a low income area where the crime statistics are high, then you can bet your bottom dollar that'll go towards crime, drugs. That is exactly where that money will go. It'll go into the pockets of the drug dealers. And for what reason? So that a, a wealthy socialist somewhere in power with influence can take a swipe at capitalism just to prove that socialism works when it never has, it never does, and it never will. I am firmly of the belief if you want money, if you want a good lifestyle, if you want the things in life that you need or want, then you fucking work for it like the rest of us. And if you really are a fan of socialism and uh, spreading the wealth, then I suggest you fuck off to some socialist hellhole where everyone is as poor as each other unlike the champagne socialists in power. 
and there we go that's my video let me know what you think in the comments and if you haven't already please consider subscribing to my stuff and sharing it everywhere i would be ever so grateful and there we go until the next time roger trout